Nestled in a beautiful part of the southwest between Busselton and Margaret River is one of the state's finest breeding properties, Oakland Park. With 300 acres of lush fertile soil, spring is a perfect time of the year to welcome the son of Lonro, Sessions, who will stand his first season at this magnificent property. Adrian Brown, a former Victorian, came to WA seven years ago and he hasn't looked back, serving all of that time at the prestigious stud owned by Neville and Susan Duncan. Came over from Victoria, um, first time in WA when I come over and um, I'm glad I stayed. It's a, it's a wonderful property, great place to raise horses and no, I'm having a great time. Springtime in the Vass area certainly promotes the region as a perfect equine environment. It should be a good start to the spring when the sun comes out. Um, there's a bit of water around, but I'm um, looking forward to it. Sessions arrived at Oakland Park in July and he has let down beautifully and appears to have settled into his new surroundings exceptionally well. Lovely natured horse. Um, he seems to take everything in his stride, um, a bit like his side did um, on the racetrack. Never had a care in the world. The horse session seems to be the same. Sessions only raced once as a two-year-old when a winner at Randwick. At three, he was in the money each of his five appearances. He was a horse they held in quite high esteem. He did win his uh, at two, then had a bit of an issue and they put him out, but he did come back in good order. As an open age sprinter, he had 11 starts, five in Group 1 company, five in Group 2 company, and his only other start was at Group 3 level. He raced against good quality opposition in each of his 11 outings. Obviously he was a Group 2 winner and, and his run, particularly his run at Mooney Valley in the Manicato was, um, was a great run. I mean buffering, that was the start of his Group 1 blitz I guess you could call it. Um, and he ran third behind buffering and Lucky Nine who's a very good horse in Hong Kong. So that was probably, probably his highlight run. He was a very talented horse. The pedigree of Sessions is impressive. By Lonro, a winner of 26 races including 11 at Group 1 level, he is the only horse of the year to go on and be crowned champion stallion. His dam, Seances, a daughter of Canny Ladd, has black type throughout her pedigree. It is a big pedigree, as you could say. Um, a big, typical of Darley's pedigree. a very big pedigree. Um, lots of speed. You know, his dam is by Canny Ladd, who was obviously a Golden Slipper winner, trained on to run third in a Cox Plate. It's been a very good sire of, uh, of very fast horses. Second dam is by Dane Hill. What more can you ask for? With the dam lines, we only have to go back a generation to discover unworldly. The champion three-year-old filly in the 2000-2001 Australian season of racing. She was a filly out of the Danehill mare spirit. Unworldly was simply superb on the track and unfortunately taken from us all too soon. John Hawkes wasn't a man to, to say a whole lot, but I, I do recall him saying one day that was probably the best horse he'd ever trained. Obviously she only had some half a dozen starts, but a freak. There is also a WA link on the dam side with Trimmer Star, a sister to the great grand dam star Aura, producer of Flaming Heart, who has been a wonderful mare for Bob and Sandra Peters. Flaming Heart is the dam of the 2015 Perth Cup winner in real love. Racing authorities and breeders Australia-wide are obsessed with speed. Sessions should fit into the WA landscape exceptionally well. Lonro, as much as he was a 2000 metre Group 1 winner, really was a very fast horse and most of his good progeny have been in that mould. Horses like Denman, Beaded, Mental. On the dam side for Sessions, you got Canny Lad, Dane Hill, K. Star. It's colonial speed. Dane Hill's an Irish horse, but I consider him colonial speed. It's just, he fits in beautifully. He raced at the highest level for two or three seasons, and he's got a good brain, really relaxed sort of a horse. Beautiful horse, beautiful, big, strong, scopey horse with, with great presence. Um, very much, I think, in the mould of his sire, Lonro. Um, we're delighted to have the horse and, and most appreciative to Daly for allowing us to stand such an exciting stallion prospect. Adrian is aware that not all stallions make the grade. However, he is convinced that Sessions has the score on the board from a pedigree perspective to excel in WA. Lonro himself has covered such a broad spectrum of mares. 
He's a real outcross, um, being Zabil line. Um, you do have the County Lad and the Danehill on the bottom, so anyone with a Danehill mare or a Danehill line mare can, can double up nicely there. Um, night shift mares, you know, Beaded's out of a night shift mare, uh, Bounding's out of a Gone West mare, so there's your Mr. Prospector side line. Uh, Denman's out of a Vane mare, so it's covered most spectrums. You, you can pretty much breed any sort of mare to him you like, and you know you're going to get a nice fast horse. Neville Duncan has never been afraid to take a risk, or to think outside the square when it comes to breeding. Sessions isn't a left field acquisition. He is a mainstream stallion that should have massive appeal to WA owners and breeders. Lonro is an established champion sire, so there's no, there's certainly no, there's no surprises here. You know, the, he's got a big pedigree, he's a really nice horse, he's by the right stallion, so yeah, it's, it's a good opportunity for anyone to get in. For bookings, contact Neville Duncan on 0417 200097 or Adrian Brown on 0438 944 299. Oakland Park, equine perfection in the southwest.